Hey everyone, this is another rapid demo of Superbase and we're now in September. So we are about six months into building the hosted platform and we've got a lot to show this month. So let's just get straight into it. Um, the first thing you'll notice is this new uh, view when you come into the table view. Pretty soon this will be the number one thing that you see when you start a new project. For now, it's still hidden away behind this toggle, but if you come into the table view, you'll see that you can now create a table directly from the dashboard. Uh, and the other nice thing is that you can even load in data uh, right from the start. So here I'm just gonna create a table, a countries table. Um, I could actually paste in data from an Excel spreadsheet or from a Google sheet, but this time I'm gonna upload a CSV. Uh, here I've got a CSV of all the countries in the world, 249, and you can see it's auto detected the columns for me and it's also uh, suggesting a primary key uh, which will always be the first one uh, and now i'll click save that will go away create the table uh, add the columns uh, it will load in all the data to the uh, countries table which i've misspelled and the countries table is good to go uh, we have a small bug here where it didn't actually show all the data but nonetheless uh, that will be fixed in the next release and uh, as you can see, once you've got your table open, it functions exactly as it would in the past, but you can also add columns now uh, directly from this view. So really you can get started setting up your whole database using this table view now. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the next thing is the auth updates. So our next release of auth um, came in September, uh, it started, started this month. And the main thing is the templates. So before we didn't have any email templates. Now we have two that you can modify yourself. You can confirm um, a sign up when someone uh, signs up to your app. And the second thing is the reset passwords emails. Uh, we have also added these to the settings. So you can disable sign up, you can uh, disable email confirmations. And uh, if you want, you can use your own SMTP server. Uh, otherwise we handle it for you. Cool, the last um, thing that I wanted to uh, note on the dashboard is the ability to invite team members to your team. So before um, you didn't have this, but it's nice now you can search for their username, which is just their GitHub username or their email that they use. Uh, that will invite people to your team and their, uh, the org will appear in their dashboard. Now, one last thing, which I think is awesome because it's a contribution from the community, is that we now have TypeScript support on our Superbase JS client. This was contributed by uh, Thor, uh, a developer who just liked what we're doing and went in and added all the types to Superbase JS. So uh, check that out uh, if you're a TypeScript user uh, and it gets all the IntelliSense uh, directly into your VS Code or, or other uh, IDE. Finally, we have uh, the ability to install Superbase directly on any web page. So if you use something like Webflow um, and you want to uh, get started using Superbase, uh, then you can just install it directly from a CDN and you start using it directly in a JavaScript script tag. Cool, so that's all for this month. Uh, enjoy and we'll see you again next month.